the organic farming uh, today let us see uh, three sessions anyhow i am going to explain all these three in separate ppts with the photos and all then only it will be clear but let us understand what is the role of these uh, things in the integrated pest management first one is natural enemies next is uh, ecological engineering and push pull strategy natural enemies these are called farmers friends beneficial insects because these are the insects which controls other insects that means the crop pests in an agricultural ecosystem if a pest is there an insect pest which is causing damage to the plants there are other insects which are natural enemies of these pests that means if agriculture ecosystem if you see the plant is at first trophic level the second trophic level is uh, the crop pest the third trophic level are these beneficial insects enemies enemy is a friend crop pests are our enemies and uh, these natural enemies are enemies of the crop pests so that's why those are our friends farmers friends there are so many natural enemies friendly insects in the agricultural ecosystem broadly they were categorized into parasitoids and predators based on their nature of attacking the insects the parasitoids again based on their nature their food which they are using as the host either egg or larva or pupa they are divided into egg parasitoids larval parasitoids and pupal parasitoids and even adult parasitoids are also present the same way the predators are also present which eats insects crop pests as their food so all these uh, parasitoids how they are useful how to produce them with photos and all i am going to explain in powerpoint presentations so that it will be easy for the people to understand next is ecological engineering even the ecological engineering concept also i am going to explain in a powerpoint presentation which is very useful to understand in the ecological engineering the major energy to drive an ecosystem is generated within the ecosystem so this is this considers agriculture as a whole as the ecosystem major energy is driven from the ecosystem itself minor energy is taken from the outside it is almost the concept of ecological engineering almost similar to the organic farming which depends on on farm inputs here also the transgenics and all are not permitted chemical usage is also prohibited so almost the ecological engineering principles are equal to the organic farming principles that's why it better suits in the organic farming the main aims of the ecological engineering are top down control and bottom up control control which is from the soil itself that is bottom up control and control of the pests using the crops above ground crops so let us see that concept also in detail in the uh, presentation form what are attractant plants what are repellent plants what are barrier or god plants what are the trap crops everything let us see in the ecological engineering how it relates to the organic farming then let us see in powerpoint presentation only push pull strategy for insect pest management in organic farming what is push what is pull what is going to push the pest what is going to pull the pest both are crops only the crop which push the pest away from the main crop the crop which which pulls the pest towards it and controls it so this is basically the push pull strategy of the integrated pest management especially this is very popular in africa in the maize ecosystem desmodium is a push crop which pushes away the pest from the maize main crop and napier grass is a pull one which pulls the pest towards it especially the maize borers and on napier grass the pest is killed so this is also i am going to explain with the detailed presentation with this 
I am signing off with the integrated pest management in organic farming. Next session is organic practices for enhancing productivity in dry areas. So let us see in our next session. Thank you. Signing off, Sri Lata.